Hi everyone, this is Shirley with Soul Star 444. Welcome to my channel. This is an energy reading for Sagittarius for September 17th, 2018. We have a big message here to release your past and you will grow from the situation as time heals all wounds. So we know when we enter challenges and transitions in life and things happen, it's really important not to hold on to those situations but to move through them. You know, acknowledge your feelings and emotions but to also let it go. And when you let it go, you can move on and be open to new experiences coming into your life. And that's the message here. You can call on Archangel Michael to help you release your past because it no longer serves you. It's in the past. And then we move on to the two of Michael. It will all be better if you just make a decision. There's no need to overanalyze find a mutual common ground to compromise and make that decision so you can move forward. We also have the two of Ariel. It's important to have balance, working multiple jobs or projects at once, making work fun. You probably make it look really easy, all the things that you do and juggle. You're a great multitasker and um, you know when to shift gears and you're very focused and business oriented. Being the Sagittarian, your focus is uh, on business 24 seven, but it's important to have balance and to maintain that balance, which means giving attention to other areas of your life and stepping back and giving time to yourself and your loved ones and your families and friends so you can have that balance. Then we have the Eight of Ariel. This is take great pride in your excellent work. So whatever projects you're working on, take pride in them. Practice makes perfect. If there are new areas that you'd like to expand into, stretch yourself and consider getting additional education or training. And you will benefit from that. And that's the message here. We have someone in your life that is very trustworthy and understanding and devoted and funny and they're looking after you. But there's so much to be, to accomplish that you need to make a very detailed plan. So you may need to sit down and write that business plan going forward. Maybe ask assistance and ask for help and do some research as to what you need so you can progress forward and successfully. And then we have the Ace of Michael, a wonderful new idea. Don't allow bumps in the road to hinder your progress. Clear up communication problems with others. Okay, so the Ace of Michael, this is a clear message that you can move full steam ahead the way is clear to you, your path is very clear, and be honest with yourself. Look for the silver lining and don't give up. Just keep moving forward, keep putting one foot in front of the other, keep making those steps and making progress and stay focused on what you're trying to achieve. Don't get distracted by other people's dramas. Stay focused on your path and you will get there. Then we have justice. Fight for justice and equality. Rulings made in your favor. Do not give up. Never, never, never give up. The angels are reassuring you with this message the right decision will be made, issues will be decided, settlements will be achieved, everyone will be treated fairly. Call on Archangel Raguel, who can help restore balance between all those involved and you will soon be able to put this challenge behind you once and for all. 
This also brings a message of empowerment that you partially created the situation that you're in. So this is what I'd like to share with you is that, you know, it's easy to place blame on other people when things aren't going our way. But we are responsible for everything that happens in our life. We as individuals are co-creators and whatever is happening in your life is, is teaching you a lesson. You're learning, you're growing, you're expanding and you have created it. by the choices you previously made. New choices can bring about new results. It's very important for you to make fair and carefully measure, measure decisions. Kindness and justice must always be extended toward everyone involved. Call upon Archangel Raguel. He's the angel to call upon whenever you find yourself in a challenging situation with someone else. He can soften the energy between two people or even groups so that a peaceful and harmonious resolution can be found. You're finding your purpose and you're starting a new life. And it's time to celebrate and have some fun. There are many blessings coming your way and also love with family members. for Sagittarius for September 17, 2018. I like the message for Sagittarius for September 17, 2018. Twelve chakras. Following the fall of Atlantis, five of our twelve chakras closed. Ascension starts when we once more activate our twelfth, fifth dimensional chakras. This begins to reconnect the twelve strands of DNA so that we can reclaim our true spiritual and psychic gifts. Many of us are familiar with the seven chakras. However, there are twelve. Your guidance is to ask the unicorns to touch open and activate your earth star, base, sacral, navel, solar plexus, heart, throat, third eye, crown, casual, soul star, and stellar gateway chakras. These are the 12 chakras. Then ask the angels to sing over you so that your chakras vibrate at a fifth dimensional frequency. Should you like to know more about the chakras, you can visit my website at www.angelheartloveriki.com and I talk about the chakra healing and about Reiki energy healing and about the importance of maintaining balance and how to clear your chakras. The affirmation for you is I awaken my 12 fifth dimensional chakras. Okay and then we have Paul, the Venetian. 
the great master Paul is Ko Kohan of the third ray. He lifts people's spirits and sets their souls free to create beauty and inspiration through music and art and also in practical ways. And this card encourages you to communicate your essence through writing, painting, or in any heartfelt manner. Call on Master Paul to help you express your visions and he will co-create them with you. These visions will hold such light that people will be touched by them, thereby accelerating the plan for Earth. Paul carries the flame of liberty and is helping to set you free. And the affirmation you can say is, I express myself creatively and harmoniously. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed your reading. And if you'd like a private reading, you can email me. Uh, click on the link below. And have a great day. Bye for now.